We are in the insulated glass lab, and what we can do here is we can fabricate from scratch insulated glass units that can be used in windows in real world applications. First thing you do is you have to clean the glass. It's very important that the glass is clean. That way you don't get fogging or marks. Then we take it over to apply the inner edge spacer. And once we've applied the spacer, then we set the other pane of glass on top very carefully. We run it through a roller press that wets out the adhesive that's on either side of the inner edge. Then we come over and we install the hot melt butyl into the very edge gap that we leave when we install the inner edge. After that, we fill it with argon gas fairly slowly so that it fills from the bottom up and you don't get a lot of turbulence. That way you get the best insulating glass unit possible. These are thermal cycling chamber and forensics area. So when we make insulating glass units, we're looking for long-term performance. So we test them to ASTM standards, which ensures that. That involves high humidity cycle testing, where we put them in the racks in our high humidity cabinets and subject them to hot, humid air circulation over a 14-day period. We subject the IGs to accelerated weather cycling where it goes from negative 20F to 140F with humidity. Back and forth for 63 days. That's an indication of, in the field, how the unit's going to perform hot and cold winter, summer life cycle. The last station, we can basically dismantle one of the IG units to see what the mode of failure was, if there was a failure. One of the biggest things we test for is we test for argon concentration, both before the testing, and then we also test at the tail end of the testing. So for that, we use the Spark-like instrument, a spectroscopic analysis of of concentration of gas. After the unit has gone through the humidity and the temperature cycling, we can measure the argon concentration, see if there's any change or loss or leakage during the evaluation. If we know that we keep our level of argon, we know that we are providing a good IG unit to a window manufacturer that maintains its thermal efficiency over the life cycle of the window. It's important to show customers best practices of making insulating glass. A customer that has never seen or made insulating glass before. They may be a glass wholesaler or a new window manufacturer. And we bring them in and we'll walk them through the process step by step. To be a certified manufacturer of IGs and or windows, you have to pass third party testing. And once you pass that testing, it's important because it allows you to meet certain building codes and specifications on different job sites. We can test using the same methods that the third party laboratories will perform to certify. Having the ability to assess from scratch, a fully functioning IG is a really beneficial capability to have here. It lets us perform real world testing, not just material properties on the ceiling itself. We're actually looking at how the IG is going to hold up in the field.